So this is our fourth year now where we're producing syrup here down in South Jersey. So the first part of the project was looking at, is it feasible to produce maple syrup in South Jersey? The main difference is being our climate's a lot different than your typical maple syrup producing regions. Uh, we have a very, we have nearly no slope down here in South Jersey and our maple species is also the red maple species as opposed to the sugar maple species up in Vermont and Canada. Uh, our goal is ultimately to create a model that we can bring to people in South Jersey and say if you want to produce maple syrup in South Jersey, here's the way that you do it and we can give them all the supplies and training that they'll need to do it and teach them every step they'll need to know along the way. This is definitely yeah, maple. Sure I think this might be ash. Got it. That's just like yeah, chunk of chunk wood. Actually, this is that's a nice sock. That's um oak, I think. That doesn't pick up. Yeah. Of course, maple syrup. And South Jersey is even a harder sell. So in North Jersey, they actually have sugar maples, which makes production more feasible than what we see here in South Jersey. So what we're doing is unique. It is one of these things that we just stumbled upon a really interesting research project. And what we're finding is that with the newer technologies, with um, the passion for, for making this happen, we're not just successful, we are in, in producing. We're also bringing a whole new culture to South Jersey. We have people who have never tasted pure maple syrup coming to our events. People who didn't know you get maple syrup from maple trees. Yes, I think uh, we get a darker syrup down here in South Jersey, and I think it has a more maple flavor to it. And we also boil it over a wood stove, so I think you get a little bit of that wood fire taste into it as well. And you'll have to try it for yourself. We are already making, making connections with um, local high schools with culinary art programs, and they're developing recipes. Stockton's Food Service is working with us to develop recipes for things like salad dressing and barbecue sauce. Um, adding value to a product by in, in, you know, including this little bit of syrup and yet creating something really special out of it. And so we feel like if we're able to pivot just a little bit where we are selling our syrup, but also providing sort of a value added um, product, that we really will be able to keep this going and make this a, a Stockton niche.